Good morning, friends. Let's go ahead and get started with calendar. All right, now we are actually in a brand new month. The other day, we ended our month of April, and we are now in May. Can you say that? May, very good. So Saturday was the first day of May, which was May the 1st. Yesterday, which was Sunday, was May the 2nd. And that means that today is May the 3rd, 2021. Can you say the date with me? May 3rd, 2021. Now we just talked about the days of the week and today is the first day of school for the week, which means that it's Monday. Yesterday was Sunday, and that means that tomorrow will be Tuesday. Now, of course, we have to add another straw for being at school today. And if you look right here, you can see my number from yesterday or from Friday is 162. I'm gonna put one more straw in my ones pocket, and that's going to make my number 163. 163. 163. All right, friends, we have a word that we're going to talk about today. What word is this? Good. Yes, this is the word good. There are three sounds in this word. G, U, D. And in this word, that O, O makes the U uh sound. Good. Can you think of a sentence using the word good? Yeah, what about you did a really good job. Okay, so let's look right here. I have a part, part, poll where we are gonna decompose a number. And you'll see that there are one, two, three right here, and one, two, three right there. Do you know what our number is? We have three and three. What number is that? It is the number six. Yes, our number of the day is six. Let's see what that would look like on the 10 frame, okay? So how many are in our first part? Three, so I'm gonna put three up here. And then for our second part, how many are there? One, two, three, so I'm going to put three more. And now you can see that three plus three equals six. Three plus three equals six. Very good job. All right, if we come over here to our pattern, let's see what comes next. Do you remember what kind of pattern this is? Let's see, we've got blue, red, green, yellow, blue, red. It's an A, B, C, D pattern. A, B, C, D, A, B. So what do I need to put for today? What comes next after this red link? Green. Very good, all right. If you look at it, can you think about what's gonna come tomorrow? Okay, we'll see. Tomorrow we're gonna add one more link to our A, B, C, D pattern. Okay, friends, so I have three numbers right here that I'm gonna hold up and I need you to tell me what the number is, okay? These are bigger numbers. These numbers are all gonna be more than 50 because we're gonna work on recognizing our numbers over the number 50. So here is my first number. It is a six and a five. What two numbers, or what number is a six and a five? 65. I know that all the 60s start with a six. Let's try another one. I have got five, eight. What number is this? Five, eight. 58. Sometimes I say it out loud just so that my brain starts thinking about what it is, like this. Five, eight. 58. Try it with this one. What number is this? Eight, two. 82. Very good job. Let me put all of these numbers back up here. And before we end calendar today, I need you to help me segment this CVC word. Okay? Remember, CVC words are consonant, vowel, consonant words, and they've got three different letters and three different sounds. 
So my CVC word today is the word bag. Can you say that? Bag. Now let's segment it. Ready? B, A, G, bag. What sound did you hear at the beginning of bag? B, which tells me it's going to be the letter B, because we remember that B makes the B sound like for ball. And the middle sound in bag was eh, eh, eh. What vowel is that that makes the eh sound? Is it the E or the I? The E, E says eh. And the ending sound was G. And I remember that's the letter G. So when you write the word bag, you get B, E, G, B, E, G. And you can see our little girl right here begging. All right, friends, have a great day. Bye.